Hi guys, welcome to another episode from West London Paranormal. We're here still in Edinburgh. Mickey's still with me. Still here. And we've been invited exclusively to this place behind us, the Banshee Labyrinth. Now, it's alleged number one most haunted pub in Edinburgh. Home to the Banshee, children's spirits running around. Who knows? But we've got two hours to have a little walk around and find out. See you in there. Ghostbuster tonight. This is Mary Queen of Scots room. Mary Queen of Scots room. It's a different eerie atmosphere already down here, isn't it? Pause it if you want to read this. Oh, yeah, hold on. Oh wow, look at this, oh, cool. Molly haunts this room. Molly haunts this room, yeah? Wow. Look at this cinema, man. This is quality, man. I want to grab in it. Yeah. Fuck yes. <clears throat> Let's sit in the back, see if we can get anything calling out. Okay guys, we're in the cinema now, in the Banshee nightclub, we've got the Alice Box going. Supposedly the most haunted pub in Edinburgh, who knows, only one way to find out. We've got the Alice Box going, got Mickey next to me, we're ready to go. So we call for the spirits, oh, adjust. adjust. So you want to adjust, that's fine, <coughs> that's fine, we can adjust, I'll adjust the camera then, yeah? So I'll put you on the big screen. <laughs> we can adjust wherever you want. Even. Even. Like your LR glare. And yeah. It's gone. Well, but then I've got the IR glare out there as well. You will have. We're gonna get it everywhere now, aren't we? Don't want to turn mine around to the screen. There you go, if I'm gonna get anything on the screen. There we go, spirit. I've put the camera on the screen. You wanted us to adjust something. So we've adjusted, we've put you on the big screen. So you could show yourself to us, couldn't you? You know, if there's a banshee in here, show us the banshee. Come forward. Yes. Yes. There is a banshee in here. There's a banshee in there, is there? Okay, Banshee. We mean you no know, harm. If you would like to communicate with us, come forward. <coughs> Use my energy. Use Mickey's energy. Can you give us a big ball on the screen right now of energy? Show yourself manifesting. Can you do that for me? Supposed to be the most haunted pub. Not showing me nothing yet, are you? There we go, you've got the Alice box there. Got the pictures there. I'm moving the camera panel around. Appear on the screen, come on. Cave. Well, we're down a cave, pretty much. We're in a cave, there's a cave down there. Away. Away? We're not going nowhere. Or well, the cave is away down there, because it's not here where we are. Possibly, yeah. Come on, spirit. We well, thank you for your communication so far. We'd like some more. Call out. Call out. Call out. <laughs> That's what we're doing. We are calling out. 
That's crazy. All right. You want us to call out? Okay. Maybe that's a sign for us to call out. All right, so I'm gonna put the camera back there. Yeah. So you're gonna call out, just chat to you. Okay, it's there, the camera's there for you. If you're here, show yourself on camera. We are calling out. Religion. 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 So what do you want to do, call out about religion? Are you Christian? Easy. Easy. What's easy? It's calling out easy. Because it's simple, it's like talking, isn't it? Yeah. That's what we're doing. We're talking, as you say, calling out, it's easy. So we are calling out to anything that resides on this land or attached to the banshee. Present. Is that part of an address that's around this area? We've come into this building blind, so we have no idea what the history is of, of this place, who is here. I know there's a child. We've just read about Molly downstairs, yeah. Molly, are you here? <gasps> Did you hear that bang? Yeah, but the bloke's here. Are you going to show yourself near the pictures? Go on then. You see the frame as what Mickey just said? Show yourself. There's King Kong there. Just checking for dust. Oh yeah, there's no dust coming up mm. on my aisle. Deborah. Deborah. Hello, Deborah. Do we have a Deborah here? My screen is blurry. Relax. Relax. We are pretty relaxed. relaxed or not? There was an orb that came out the. Yeah, that's why we started testing. It came out here and went up. Dust. I'll have to have a look at that back. But there's no dust when you're banging. No, no, it really comes out. No. So come on, Deborah, Molly. If you're a child, run up and down. Show us. Can we hear your footsteps? Come on, play in this room. Hi guys, we are in the cave bar of the Banshee Labyrinth. Mickey, what's the story here? Uh, well, this is where Mr. Boots, the famous Mr. Boots from the Edinburgh Vaults, is heard walking down the corridor, chains rattling, and it seems to stop at the entrance to this room. Mr. Boots, does he like men? No one knows really, do they? Supposedly, if you, if you watch the TV shows, he doesn't like men. He doesn't like being uh, antagonised by men either. She's the, the lady, SJ said, um, he likes to move them on. He likes to move ladies out of the area, so... Um, that would be interesting. I wonder if we could get Mr Boots in here tonight with us. I wonder if he can make us move on. Who knows? Don't know. He can have a go. Let's go. So guys, we are in the cave room now. This is the room, as we said earlier, where Mr. Boots is. They can hear his footsteps behind. Coming through that door there. Are we gonna hear him? Who knows? That staff. That's not him. <laughs> so here we go. We are gonna use the PSP, PSB7. See if we can pick it up. Oh, that's better than that. Yeah, there's no fish on the ground. So anyone who's still looking through this map is brilliant. Mr. Boots, are you here? Now it's a 
and come forward and talk to us. Don't want to reach chairs off the side. You've been known to walk through corridors, haven't you? Give me a name. Use the static blade to come forward. Mickey's there. Do you look like Mickey sitting in the corner? Um, it's great to uh, try and communicate with you tonight. Would you like to tell us your name? That's a whining noise. Is it? Stop. Hundred percent. Was that your voice? Who was that? Was that a lady? Was that one of the ladies that were kept here? <coughs> Can you give us a female voice to come through? Come on. We like to scare the ladies down here. Down for it. And we've got two grown men here. It's this one, isn't it? You're right, Mickey. Yeah. Come affect one of us. Affect Mickey. He loves to be affected, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> affect uh. me. Why not? You can't affect me because you're weak. You don't like being antagonised, do you? Yeah, we don't know who that is. Good spirit that is. You didn't tell us, did you? No, no. We've got to find out for ourselves. Yeah. It's fair enough, which is good, because we like to come in blind. I'm sorry, I guess. Molly! Molly, Molly, a child Molly. that loves to wander around here. A handprint has been seen on the window as well. A child's handprint, which I'll just show you right now. That was taken by one SJ that works here. Uh, they did have it examined, no children are allowed in the bar, and it was on, on the inside, so... Can you say one of our names? I've got a headache. Headache, yeah. Above my right eye. It's not good. It's not bad, bad. Are you affecting Mark in some way? You did say, come and affect me. Yeah, I was only joking. <laughs> you don't joke, you're I'm the spirit of it. You're antagonised. It's like a, a stabbing pain here. Yeah. I'm sure it does. Is that you affecting Mark? Give us something brave, make us jump. Give us that excitement we've been looking for here. Blow one of the lights out, or don't, as I'm only joking. But, tap Mickey, Mickey's gone outside now. Show yourself on that camera. We know you like playing around games here. We love your feet here and along the floor. I heard someone thinking it was someone, I did say, didn't I, so yeah. they're walking around. Yeah, it's no one down here. Footsteps, it's not far there. Oh, that's the fish. fish. You hear footsteps? When I turn this off, when I have this covered, this is I keep thinking there's someone just there. All right. Unless the sound travels really, really loud through the building. Now, here I would I'd be annoyed that we're in here and he'll come this way. Or we, he will So, guys, so guys, we are now. Where are we now, Mickey? This is the corridor, the corridor towards the cave bar. Cave bar and the poltergeist room. We'll get into that in a minute. Voices, EVPs have been heard down here, very strong EVPs. We're gonna stand here right now and we're gonna see if we can pick up anything on EVP. Or oh, we can hear the footsteps. Who knows? EVP session one, walkway towards the cave room. Okay, calling out for the spirits to reside down this corridor or in this club itself. 
You've given out great EVP evidence before with your voice. Can you tell us your name or do you have a message? Thick, solid concrete. That's weird, then. There was definitely footsteps. Mm. Boom, 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 boom. Probably clear as day. But they seem like female footsteps, didn't they? Yeah, that's solid concrete. You'll never hear any footsteps through there. If it was like wooden floor and it's like normal house structures, then yeah. Well, that's weird. Green products. Guys, we're now entering this place. This place is renowned for poltergeist activity. The poltergeist name is Colin, but now we're going to see if we can antagonise Colin. Who knows? I can make a blue video. Do that. Scream? Yeah. There must be some natural cause for the screams. You're now in the poltergeist room, what they call the poltergeist, because this is renowned for their poltergeist activity. They call it Colin. Um, supposed to be a nice poltergeist. Never heard of one. But we have placed a hand sanitizer bottle there, securely on the side there. Will it push it off? Who knows? Who knows, Colin? So, Colin, if you're here, my name's Mark, and this is Mickey. Hello, Colin. Nice to meet you. We're ghost hunters, paranormal investigators. We look for people like you. Do that tap. Look at them. Colin, do you want some money? There's 10 English pounds there. Well, Colin, yeah, look at that money. Listen, Colin. You want some cash? Look. Come and take it. One bang for yes, two bangs for no. Colin, do you want money? <coughs> one foot. Star. 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 That was one for yes. Did you not hear that? I heard, I heard the. The van, yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll try that again. Colin, you got money. Colin, remember, one bang for yes, two bangs for no. Are you in this room with us right now? Feels quite warm in here. <clears throat> Just give off heat. Possibly. Mm, no, not really. All right, Colin, this is a challenge for you. Right, one for yes, two for no, bangs. Can you knock that off? That's two or three, yeah. Do, do, that do. was footprints, set them, sorry, footsteps out there. I'm sure. Laugh. No. Laugh? Are you laughing Are you at laughing us? Are you laughing at us, Colin? Well, I'm gonna put that on the edge there so you can. Well, do you want more than 20 quid off Mickey? More than 10 off? You'd be lucky, I'm tight. Yeah. Got money there as well, Colin. Can you use your power? Can you use your energy just to blow it off? Do you want another turn on? I'm gonna move the camera around so you can see it more clearly. So there we go. We've got the bottle there of hand sanitizer, two twenty pound notes. Sorry, two ten pound notes. So Colin, remember one bang for yes, two bangs for no. Can you knock that off? Do you have the power to knock that bottle off? Well, my money. Not impressed, Colin. Not impressed. I know you go through quiet periods, but we're only here once. Come on. Yeah. Knock it on the floor. Knock the notes. Make us jump. Scare us. So guys, just an experiment. We've left this here. We're going to go to another area, another part of the bar upstairs. We left that here. We're going to visit later. Will Colin make an appearance and push it? We'll see you soon. Bar 13. Unlucky. For some. In this room is where 
the stalls were... They, they deliberately put the stalls now on the floor. Um, the stalls are now placed on the floor in this room, we've been told, because that's how they feel safe. Because when they stack the stalls, things get thrown about. So... Okay, should we take a seat at the table? Yeah. Up here, you can Let's take a seat. Spirit box. Spirit box. This place is renowned for poltergeist activity. Things being thrown. We're now going to do an EVP session. EVP session, bar 13. Spirit, anything that resides residual energy in this room, I ask you to come forward, use this recorder, come close to it, use your voice, tell us a message. Do you like us here? Do you want us gone? We're in bar 13, and lucky for us, I suppose. Now, I want to know why, when the staff stack the stools in here, you like to throw them on the floor. Do you think that's funny? Is it a game? Is this, in fact, Colin coming from the, the snooker room? room. Glasses have been broken, things have been thrown around. Um, um, if there's any spirits in here, 
I asked you to give us your name on the Alice box. Tell us who you are. Apparently you scare the hell out of SJ who works here. You know who she is? <laughs> Do you not want to talk anymore? I'm going to take some pictures if you can get in the way. Come on. Play a game with us. You don't like us here. Tell us to go. Yeah. Yeah? It's been a year. Come on, Spirit. It's your final chance to pass a message over before we close up. They said they've had a quiet time, but you know, we're only here once. Can you copy what we're doing? Can you make a noise? Can you make a bang? No, you can't, can you? because you're not as strong as what people say you are. Or is it you like to play games with the women? It's because you're a That's disrespecting, I won't go that far. 27, she got says a nice little quick wrap up of that. Right, thank you spirits, whoever you are in here. Kurt, we'll go with Kurt, because that's what came through. Uh, thank you for talking. And our time here is done. We thank you so much. Thank you so much. Um, we're now done. Um, we've had some names come through. Should we go check if that bottle's still been moved upstairs? Forgot about yeah. that. Yeah. Go to the portal. We're gonna go to the portal guys' room quickly. Is there still? Colin, you disappoint me. Oh well. We'll leave that there, and then we'll let the staff know. So guys, we have just finished filming the Banshee Labyrinth. Mickey, what do you make of it? It was good, such a nice place, such a creepy, weird looking pub. It's my sort of pub, definitely. I'd love to work here, to be honest. Oh yeah. So many floors as well. Each floor sort of has its own spirit. Like theme as yeah, well. Yeah, it's, it's own it's theme. Strange. It's really good. Um, yeah, big shout out to the staff there. Um, yeah, yeah, they took us everywhere. They gave us the stories, everything. All the social media for them will be in the end of the video. Um, and from me and the Banshee Labyrinth and Mickey, what a night. We're going to rest now. We are knackered. Yeah, always, always knackered. <laughs> always knackered. I don't know why. Ghost hunting takes us out of it. <laughs> See you later, guys. Great See you in the next video. See you in a bit.